Hey, welcome back to the Segway YouTube channel. We're here today with Craig. He's brought down his EP3. Introduce yourself, Craig, and what we're doing here. Uh, well, my, obviously, my name's Craig. Uh, I've brought my EP down today because uh, Tegway kindly sponsored it. Uh, so I just thought I'd come down and thank all the guys in person. So, yeah, we're going to have a look around it. Obviously, it's pretty eye catching. Let's talk about the, the exterior of the car and um, the livery. Uh, yeah, well, it was one of them. I've uh, got a disease called ulcerative colitis, um, so I've not spoke about it in the entire time I've had it. Typical guy, really. Uh, while I was in a hospital recently, um, I decided that I was going to raise as much awareness as I could for it, really, because uh, it's pretty well, it's not really known. Um, so, yeah, I came up with the idea of putting a livery on the car and sort of sticking it in everyone's faces, really. Um, so, yeah. Yeah, you've got it all around the car and you've also got like, you've also got the brands as well, not not just the awareness. So you, you, you're quite into your cars as, as well then? Yeah. Uh, what do you use the car for? Um, mainly it's for track days really yeah. and obviously raising awareness. I've started to go to a lot of shows, things yeah. like that. So um, it's just trying to get the car as many places as possible really, yeah. uh, getting it getting it seen. Um, and it's all been pretty positive. I've tried to mix the companies, so there's sort of car companies and uh, awareness sort of into one. Yeah, trying to do something a bit different really. Yeah. So, yeah. Because normally it's like one or the other, but I guess it gets petrol heads into... Yeah, well that's it. It's it out there. Yeah, it's sort of, it, it's two conversations. So if one doesn't like one thing, they sort of speak yeah. about the other, so yeah. yeah. So what sort of modifications we've got? I see the, the front splitter there and the, the the bonnet, um, yeah, talk to me a bit about the exterior modifications. Uh, exterior wise, um, it's got the Evo 8 Enki alloy wheels uh, running standard brakes. I've had them done by VTEC Monkey, so they've all been rebuilt. Yeah. Uh, running PBS pads front and back. It's our Nankang NS2Rs from you guys. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, Exhaust wise on the rear, I think it's a spoon copy at the minute, but I'm looking to change it to one of the, I think it's the new Miltec one, isn't it? Yeah, that's right, yeah, yeah. the Civic Cup sort of one. Yeah, um, and obviously the livery, the Mugen wing. Uh, exterior wise, it's just little bits, like, like I say, the splitter, yeah. some new headlight, just things that make it look a bit cleaner, you know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. What suspension are you running? Uh, Master R's. Okay. Um, so, yeah, they've, I, I can't fault them on road and on track. Yeah. I think they're absolutely brilliant. Quite comfy on the road as well? Comfy-ish. Yeah, they're not, for coilovers. Yeah, for coilovers, yeah. They're, not, they're a lot better than some of the ones I've had in the past, so, yeah. yeah. Can we have a look inside and yeah, uh, nice. see some big bucket seats in there? Bucket seats, uh, Luke harnesses. Yep. Um, Cody steering wheel, which I'm, on, I'm after changing. I want mine getting a personal one. Uh, SW Motorsports half cage. Yeah. Is uh, that like a custom colour? As well? yeah, yeah, they said what's your brightest colour, <laughs> uh, and they did that for me. It matches the delivery really yeah, well. well I, I know it sounds daft, but I sort of had the cage done before, and uh, then I said everything that has uh, to yeah. match the. Uh, yeah, it looks really good. Yeah. That does. And then there's like bits and pieces like the, um, the fire, fire extinguisher, uh, holder, and breast. Just little things. Yeah. Um, so how long have you had the car for? Uh, five, six years now. And you bought it completely? Stopped. Standard, yeah. I think it just had a, a K&N Typhoon. Yeah. Uh, that's all it had on it. So it's yeah. come a long way uh, since then. Yeah, to say I'd never modify it in any way, shape or form. Yeah, yeah it's come a long way now. And can we have a look under the, yeah. under the bonnet? It's not the cleanest under the bonnet, but... And what sort of engine modifications have we got going on? Uh, basically, just the Cane and Typhoon, okay. which again I'd like to swap. It's mapped yeah. uh, by Paul West. Uh, uh, the rocker cover done by one of you guys, I think, that work here. Uh, Andrew Ford, 4D, yeah, so, 4D yeah. Customs, shout out. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, uh, but other than that, it's all like polybushed everywhere, uh, yeah. stuff like that. So. so, it's just ready for you know abuse on the track? Yeah, nice it's just, it literally, yeah, it literally gets driven there. Yeah. Uh, driven round and then driven home again yeah. so yeah no it's good like everything that you've you've put on it obviously it's not it's not overkill you've not no, thrown yeah. thrown yeah. a catalogue at it yeah, like i'd it, like to if i yeah i'd like to throw the catalogue at it but it's uh it's just one of them it's like how far you go and like you say the reliability side of it i think if i ever went any further with it i'd probably look at a supercharger i don't think i'd turbo it because i'd still want to put it on track yeah um so yeah nice and where can people find you on socials? Uh, I'm on social media as Driven to Fart UK. Uh, 
uh, on Instagram, and I'm also Driven to Fart on Facebook as well. Nice. Cool, so I think that pretty much sums up our video. Thanks again to Craig for bringing his car down, and do make sure you drop him a follow, because if you're into cars, and he's doing a great thing here, raising awareness. So yeah, definitely make sure you drop him a follow. And yeah, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one. Cheers, mate. Thank you.